Hey guys, welcome to Nate's Carving Creations. I hope you enjoyed part one of this series because today we're gonna work on finishing the skull. Okay, I'm gonna continue feathering out back here and I'm gonna try to make a pivot point for the lower jaw to connect. Just a little bit of rounding and shaping the cheekbones, stuff like that, and then we'll call the skull finished. So, my protection, check, and let's get carving. Okay, so there's the skull that might be <laughs> about as good as it gets, but we'll see. So now I'm going to clean it up. I'm going to torch it and then I'm going to brush it, probably do a little bit of sanding and we'll see what she looks like.
to look nice after it's whitewashed so now I'm gonna finish this cigarette and cut a piece to try to uh, form into the lower jaw there's the skull so I'll be right back all right so I've got this little chunk cut out to be the um, bottom jaw, okay? I'm gonna have to feather away some from the sides here on the skull, which is fine. He, he doesn't have a finish on him right now. So, and then I'm thinking that when I, when I go to attach, this to the um, to the skull. I'm probably going to get some wooden dowels, just feather through, and uh, glue the dowels all the way through to where they're connecting both pieces. If you if you have any experience with this kind of stuff. I'm always taking tips, okay? Always. This is my first go at actually assembling something that I create. So, any tips are very welcome. So, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to level out the two, two sides right down around the, where the jaw's gonna connect. And then, we'll start in on this piece.
so that um, my guy, my skeleton, might not have a lower jaw because I'm going to have to do some thinking on uh, how to do that. But uh, my ultimate goal for this project is to do the entire skeleton. And uh, besides, like, uh, when I finish the neck, I'll put a screw up there to hold it in place until I'm ready to glue it all together with wooden dowels. But the end product, I want to be only wood and glue, okay? So, speaking of neck, that's, that's what I'm going to do next. This upper part, um, spinal column. So, the spine, I'm probably going to do the spine in two pieces. Just the neck, and then <clears throat> all this down here. Because that, I know, would be easy enough to uh, fix together. All right? So, then, once I get this section done, I'll have the rib cage to do, and that could be a pain in the ass. But, if he turns out all right, it'll be worth it. If you guys like him, it'll be worth it. And who knows? He might go up to sale exclusively for my YouTube subscribers. Okay? I'll decide that when he's done. So, I'm going to go find a good-sized stick to shape into the neck, and I'll be right back.
Okay, guys, so there's the neck. And that's how it's going to connect there, or where it's going to connect. For the time being, I'm just going to try putting the screw through it. So. And I'll be right back and see what happens. Okay, so my drill just died on me, but <clears throat> I learned something. So instead of using a dowel on <clears throat> the spine, I'm going to try just simply gluing it, gluing it together. So because the screw split the top of the um, spine there, so it's gonna take some glue on that. But we're one step closer to a finished wooden skeleton. So, as always, until next time, keep on carving. I love you guys, y'all are awesome. Peace out.